So what is it? All right, so we have yeah. You, they listen to you, and then they are, they're gonna oh, ask, ask you questions. Well, everybody's going crazy. Oh my gosh! <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, Sana Queen! Oh well, hi, right. hi me. <laughs> questions for Sana, guys. Okay, questions, questions. What is your favorite tree? <laughs> okay, that's a very random question. Well, for the anyone, Christmas tree, of course. For anyone who doesn't remember or who doesn't know, uh, she's gonna be <laughs> commenting uh, for Sweden. Yes, commenting this yes. year, mm -hmm. commentator. Yes, that's a new challenge. It's my new job. <laughs> uh, yeah, do you miss you? the Eurovision bubble, Sana? Well, I have missed it, and I'm so glad to be back in this bubble. And would you do Melody Festival in again? Well, you can never say never. So, um, uh, yes, I hope so. Some someday. Favorites. This uh, year. Favorites this year, of course, Sweden. I think we have a great oh, entry uh, this year as well as last year. I think, <laughs> and uh, then uh, I have. Uh, Oh, well, <laughs> well oh, sorry. I, I thought Italy. I think is is very good. And uh, where, where where are you from? Uh, we're from Mexico and Argentina. <laughs> so you, you can feel free to say Mexico and Argentina. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think there's a lot of good entries this year. What's your best Eurovision experience? Uh, well, last year when uh, when I, I stood on stage and the crowd was uh, singing along with me in Undo and uh, it was they were so loud so I couldn't hear the music in my ears. So I, I was panicking for a few seconds but uh, but uh, it, it was a wonderful feeling as well. Wow. Mm -hmm. uh, how was the hosting Melody Festival experience? Uh, well, yes, I was the host of Melo this year and uh, it was fantastic. I've never hosted any show before so, uh, so I, I was very happy to be able to do that. Someone wants you to host actually Eurovision. Oh! <gasps> If Sweden wins. Oh maybe next my year, gosh, well, that's year. very tempting. <laughs> <laughs> Did you give Mons any advice? Well, he, he, does, he doesn't need any advice, actually, if I could be honest. But, uh, but I know that it, 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 it's, a lot of, it's a lot of things to do when you're here. So uh, I, I just said to him to uh, take extra hours of sleep whenever you can, <laughs> because you're gonna need it. <laughs> Okay. Favorite song in the last ten years. Undo. <laughs> <laughs> of course. <laughs> now, what What does undo my sad mean? Uh, undo my sad. Well, you actually can relate to that in many uh, different uh, angles. I think uh, everybody has uh, their own story to it. But for me, it's like uh, I I don't want to be sad anymore. I don't want to just bring me out of uh, of that feeling because I have moved on and I just need to. Uh, you know, do it, it p persuade myself. Well, can I butt in with a question actually? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. So, you took seven times to get to Eurovision, and Mons, it was his third time, I think. Yeah. Is there anybody from Melody Festival and any sort of favourites who you would like to see being given a chance? Melody in Melody Festival, it hasn't been yet. Uh, Shirley Clamp. Shirley Clamp, <laughs> yes, please. Yes, she yes. She really deserves it. Definitely. You've been asked a lot of times okay. if you can sing a little bit. Um, uh, I'm my side, or whatever. You, what, what do you want? Hey, I'm <laughs> Yay! Yeah. What do you want to hear? <laughs> Someone was asking in Swedish, what do you think about uh, Mons's chances? Yes, I, I think that he has very good chances to uh, to uh, take a, a great place in this Eurovision contest. Hello there. I'm going to have to take you. Yes. I'm sorry. Okay, Thank you very much. I have to go to.